okay. So, hey everybody, uh, it's, uh, we're, <laughs> I don't usually intro videos, I just usually get going with the call. <laughs> yeah, it's just so much different, because usually I watch your videos and I hear this exact same thing. Uh, anyway, we're gonna, uh, I'm here with, uh, oh god, this is not good. Um, just say ellipse. Or okay, whatever. ellipse, Revolts. yeah. Yeah, scammers revolts, is it? Yeah, scammers revolts. Oh, yeah, well, okay. <laughs> I can't even remember your own channel name. <laughs> I have so many channels that, yeah. <laughs> oh, God. All right. Yeah, so um, we're going to be uh, contacting this fake tech support. It was, uh, oh, I don't even remember what I typed in. I think it was, I don't remember what it was, TT Twitter, I think it was. Uh, should I, if we give them the number, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say the number because... Uh, I was just at, I was in Vegas, just at that hotel, and I'm going to give him the number that, that's for my hotel. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that would be interesting. Yeah. I could just give him the number that I have, though, so they can call back, I guess, but yeah, that'd be... Oh, you're using, because you're using... Uh... Yeah, yeah. Alright. Alright, I'm going to start the call. Can you hear that? Yeah. Okay. Thank you for calling technical support. My name is Malcolm. How may I help you today? Hi, Malcolm. I had a um, a pop-up on my computer saying that my personal photos, Facebook, and other passwords and credit card information could be at risk. Uh, it says uh, this, uh -huh. uh, this means... All right, All right, sir. So you have some kind of an error message on your screen, right? Yeah, uh, yeah. You said, what was your name again? All right, sir. Can you please go ahead and read that message for me? <sighs> Okay, it says, um, attention, charter communications customer, your personal photos, Facebook, and other personal passwords, such as credit cards, information could be at risk. This requires media attention. Contact tech support immediately with your number, 844. Oh, can you, okay, sir, can you please let me know when was the first time you got this message on your screen? This is the first time. I just, I was trying to go to Google, and it came up, and it's playing an awfully right, horrible you, robot voice, uh -huh. saying my computer's infected. Awfully horrible. All right, sir, can you please let me know, is this a Windows computer or is this a Mac computer? Yeah, it's a Windows computer. What was it? Windows 7, 8, 8.1 uh, or Windows I think it's 10? a... Isn't this Windows 9? I, I don't remember. We're, I'm here... I was watching on the news and they said something about... Hello? New ...Windows security yeah. thing. We're still here. Sorry, I'm here. My roommate's on the line. Uh, this is our this is our computer together. Okay. Um, All right. Yeah, I don't. I don't know what it is. I think it's Windows Seven. Well, it's got like a green button at yeah. the bottom. All right. And how old is the computer? Uh, I I got it like in the early two thousands. All right. So it's sixteen years old. I, I guess. And when was the last time you got this computer serviced? Uh, do, do we ever get it serviced? Well, I bring it to that guy that, that kind of looked sketchy that one time. Yeah, I don't. I don't think we ever did. I think I think all he did was like. Oh, sure. What the best I can do now? I can go ahead and connect to your computer screen so I can look into your computer. Why have you got such a message? Diagnose your computer and get to the root cause of the computer's problem. Okay. For that, okay. you just need to follow some simple steps. All right. Okay. Oops. Okay. okay. So have a look on your keyboard. On the bottom left Keep corner on. of your keyboard, there yep. is a control key which says C T R L key. Do you see that key? <laughs> yep, I see that. And just at the side of that key, there is a key which says F and key. Do you see that F and key? Uh, yeah. All right, sir. Do you see a key with a four flag on it? It's called the Windows or a Microsoft key. It's a key with a four flag on it. Yeah, is it? Yeah, I see that. Do you see that key? Like yeah. Yeah, I see it. All right. I want you to press and hold that key with one finger. Okay. Keep it hold and keep it pressed. Do not release your finger, and with the other finger, press the letter R, R as in Romeo. Okay. It came up with a run thing. It says, it says type a program folder, document, internet source, and Windows open it for you. Oh, well, that's wonderful. Oh, well, there would be a space where you can type in some numbers or messages in it. The space must be white in color. Do you see that space? Yes, I do. Oh, well, so you need to type in there I as in Indiana. Okay. Hold on just a second. Uh... E as an elephant. Okay. <laughs> okay. X as an X-ray. X as an X-ray. P as in Pennsylvania. 
<laughs> he is in Pennsylvania. Sorry, I have a bad cold. L as in London. Oh, just a second. O as in Oscar. Uh, hold on. R as in Romeo. O as in Oscar. Romeo. <laughs> then E as in elephant. <laughs> okay. <coughs> Sorry, so I have, uh, you want me to read it back to you? I beg your pardon, sir? You want me to read it back to you what I have? Or, or do, uh, you want so, me, do you want me to so click that, okay? Is that, is that, is that run box still there on your screen or is, it, it has gone away? It's still, do you want me to click okay? No, sir, please do not click okay. Give us space now. Okay. Now type in www. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm sorry, I got a bad cold. <coughs> dot Okay L as in London Okay P as in Pennsylvania Yeah, I don't think e that's how you type it. I think you gotta put another U <laughs> Number was... one, two, three I can't spell uh... Dot com, C-O-M Okay, you want me to push okay? All right. So, can you please go ahead and read the message for me, which you ha which you have just typed in right now, just for a confirmation? I just want to make it sure that you have typed the right message. Okay. It says Windows cannot find. Uh, uh, hold on a second. It says it, Windows cannot find. It says it cannot find Indian X-ray elephant, Pennsylvania, London Oscar Romeo, elephant www dot London Pens one two three dot com. Ends. Oh, so there will be a space between I Explorer and www. Have you put a space between I Explorer and www? Uh, no. This is what I have. I have Indiana Elephant X-ray Pennsylvania London Oscar Romeo Elephant www dot London Pennsylvania one two three dot com. Wait, I think you. Did, oh, so I, th I think you did the space W. Space between I Explorer and www. There should be a space between I Explorer and www. Is it? Oh, okay. Yeah, I get you have oh, to right, so you have to read everything oh, back right, to so me because everything's all screwed up. Oh, right, so and it's, it's www dot lpe one two three dot com. Okay. Lpe one two three. Dot com. Okay. Oh, that looks way. Cool. It's www dot lpe one two three dot com. All right. Uh, okay, it says um, session key or something. And have you gave a dot between I Explore and www? It says, it says session key. It needs a key or something. Uh, what's it now? Please go ahead and click on OK. I I'm waiting for a key. It says it needs a key. What, is that a key to, like, log into your computer or something? I think so. It needs... It wants a session key. Oh, sir, can you, sir, can you to let me know what do you exactly see on your screen right now? It says session key. Support portal. Oh, what, ma'am? All right, sir. Now, I would be providing your session key. Your session key is 292... 292... 1607. 1607. Okay. All right, so now please go ahead and click on submit. Okay. Alright, I'll save it. I'm sure it's oh, well, safe. Sure. Can you please let me know what do you exactly see on your screen right now? Uh, it says, uh, I'm about to start uh, a session with uh, Malcolm D. something. Yeah, that's my name. That's Austin. Malcolm DeCosta. Okay. Oh, what's it? Do you see any option that says downloads? Uh, yeah, I already downloaded it. Uh, what, do you see any option that says download? It's like connecting right now. I already downloaded it. So please go ahead and click on download. <sighs> it says... Okay. Alright, sir. Sure. Now there would be an option which says allow. Please go ahead and click on allow. I'm sure it's safe. Okay. Oh, so do you see the cursor moving automatically on your screen? Whoa! 
That's cool. Unfortunately, I do. All right, that's me working on your computer, on okay? Basic, right? Yeah. Are you there? Yeah, I'm still here. Go ahead. All right, so now what I will do, I will go ahead and diagnose your computer, get to the root cause of your computer's problem, okay? Okay. All right, so do you have any antivirus? Do you have any protection on this computer? Uh, I, I don't know. Because, sir, I cannot see any antivirus on this computer. There mm. are no protection on this computer. Alright? Uh, that's not good. Did, did you want to see the pop-up? Sir, so that pop-up was a spyware, alright? Oh, uh, okay. That was a very intelligent spyware. Okay, um, which must have got entered into your computer when you were working online. Okay. Because you don't have any protection on this computer, okay? Now I will go ahead and check the internal security of a Windows computer. Every Windows computer have two kind of internal inbuilt security. One is a firewall and other is the network access protection, alright? I'm sure they do. Now I will go ahead and check the internal security of a computer. Okay. So the, the good news, so the good news is that that your firewall is working, all right. So does that mean that there's on. no viruses? That's a good news. Okay. Are you there? Yeah, I'm still here. I'm dying slowly. Stas. Well, sir, can you please let me know your name so I can assist you in a more professional way? Uh, well. My name is Richard, and then uh, my roommate. Uh, my name, my That's a wonderful Tom. name, Richard. And oh, Richard, now what I can do, I can go ahead and check the temp files of your computer. Temp files are those files which get downloaded onto your computer whenever you are working online. If you don't, do not have a good antivirus or a good security onto your computer, okay? Uh, okay. <laughs> and Richard, can you please let me know, is this the only computer you have, or do you have other computer as well? Uh, this is the only computer I have. I'm a hobo. Well, I got a computer too, but... This is the only computer you have, right? <laughs> yeah. Oh, Richard, these are the temp files of your computer. These are the garbage files of your computer, which must have got downloaded onto your computer when you were working online. These files forces your computer to work slow or, and even forces the computer to give a sluggish performance. These files should be removed as soon as possible, okay? Wait, so, that, so that's the virus then? Are you getting my point? Yeah. Can you hear my, uh, my roommate? Well, Richard, now I will go ahead oh, and me. give a scan to your computer. Let's see how many junk files oh. and other issues you have on this computer, okay? Uh, okay. You know, you're a joke.
Alright, sir, have a look on your screen. This is a legitimate scan. It's <laughs> I'm sure it is. Scan which I'm this performing on your computer, okay? Okay. Wait, hello? Yeah. Is this, this your guys' website? Let us know how many junk files and other issues you have on no, your computer, sir. right? <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, what? So this is a legitimate Microsoft Partner scan which I am performing on your computer. Okay. This scan will let us know how many infections and junk files you have on this computer, okay? Okay. Wait, hello, can you hear me? I don't think he can. One, two, three for now. Oh, hold on, I got the wrong channel turned up. And Richard, can okay. you please let me know there. what kind of okay. work do you do on this computer? Do you do any online shopping or online banking on this computer? Uh, I, I do my online banking, but I just use that as my home computer. All right. Mm -hmm. uh, can you can you hear my uh, roommate on the other line? Hello. A big, a big pardon, sir. Can you hear my roommate? Yeah. Can you hear me? Yes, sir. I can hear you. Okay. Oh, okay. I, no, so I was just, I was asking, I was, I was asking you if, uh, if you guys had a website. Yes, sir, we do have a website. Oh, okay. W would we be able All to right. see it? <laughs> I, oh, so I will surely let you know who are you talking to and who we are, okay? Oh, okay. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Oh, sir. Oh, no. Oh, well, Richard, can you please let me know, at times, do you feel that the computer is working slow or giving you a sluggish performance? Uh, yeah, I guess so. Mm Alright, so the scan has been started onto your computer. The scan is partnered by Microsoft, alright? I doubt it, but okay. And let's see how many system issues, privacy items, junk files, malware, and software issues you have on this computer, okay? Uh, okay. What's malware? So malware is a special kind of intelligent infection which can enter into your computer, alright? If you do not have a good antivirus on your computer, or a good security oh. onto your computer, okay? But how does like how does it actually get in? Because sir, you do not have a good security, you do not have an antivirus on your computer. That is the reason such kind of infection get has the privilege to get into your computer, okay? Oh, okay. Is there like a certain website that you have to go to to get it? I beg your pardon, sir. Is there like a certain place on the internet you have to go to to, to like get it? So please do not worry about that. First, let me diagnose your computer. I will after that I will let you know what are the things which is needed to done onto your computer, and after that I will surely let you know how you can get your, these things done onto your computer. Okay? Oh, okay. Alright sir, you can see on this screen that the system issues is 10, the privacy item is more than 20, that's makes 22, and the junk files okay. are 75, alright. 
and let's right. check how many malware you have on this computer. Okay. Oh, what's your till? Which till then we can go ahead and check the drivers of a computer. Do you know what are drivers and what they do? Uh, no, they drive. I don't I know. Sure, I will, I will, yeah, I will like surely let you know. No, sir, I will surely let you know what are drivers and what they do. Okay. Okay. Hello? I'm still here, I haven't died yet. So what are we doing now? Okay. Is this gonna fix it? Oh, what's your now? I will be transferring this call to my senior technician, all right? Oh, great. Okay. <laughs> Thank you a lot for Jesus. being online. Oh, here. Oh. Take oh. a step back. <laughs> hey, who are you now? Yeah. Hi, sir. How are you doing today? Uh, good. Who are you? Like, take your mouth away from the phone a little bit. Jesus. Yeah, sure. There we Thanks go. a lot for asking, sir. I'm doing good, okay? Uh, as you can see, sir, my one of my technicians, so far as he has told me, that he have got some kind of infected files in a computer. As you can see, he has run a scan, and even you can see the result. Can you see this? Uh, yeah, I, I And the scan so. is still in progress. Right? Uh, right? Yeah. Absolutely. Is this so, going to fix it? By the it? way, uh, I beg your pardon, sir. Is this is this scan thing going to fix it? Absolutely, sir. I'm one of the senior technician on the floor. There's a there's a reason the call got transferred to me. So I'll go ahead and definitely fix it for you. Okay. You guys have like a where are you guys located at? Uh, sir, actually, your voice is breaking up, okay? Oh, go, uh, sorry, where are you guys, like, located at? Okay, we are located in New Delhi, India. Oh, okay. Yes. Have you ever been to India, sir? Uh, uh no. Is it true that they... Okay. Um, oh, I'm not going to ask that, never mind. So, sir, what exactly you were doing on the computer when you got this, the pop-up on the screen? Well, uh, he was probably, you know. I don't know. I was just going online and this pop-up came up. Yeah, we. Uh, he watches, like, so much YouTube. He probably has, like, 3 million viruses. Uh, sir, I'm so sorry. You're just breaking up. Please be a bit He, he watches a lot of bad videos. I was asking, sir, what exactly you were doing on the computer when you got that warning message on the screen. All right, all right, all right. We can hear you. He was watching videos. I was watching your videos on the internet. Good lord. Pushy. Okay, let me just go ahead and check a few parts of your computer, sir, okay? Just me a moment. Is it your computer, sir? Are you the only one who is using this? 
Yeah, and my roommate. Okay. And how old is this computer? Mm, about as old as dirt, I would say. So, 2000. Okay. So, I think... Uh-huh, absolutely, sir. Let me just go ahead and check to part of your computer. Just give me a moment, okay? Okay. Okay, just have a look here, sir. Can you see all this file? Can you recognize any one of them? Uh, no, I don't. Is they, are they bad files? Oh. Absolutely, sir. These are the infections, infected files you have got in a computer. Oh, dear lord, they're infections? Can... What? Absolutely, sir. I swear that wasn't me. Yes. Yes, that's, that's what you have heard. These are the infections you have got in a computer. And not just this. Let me just go ahead and check the other part as well. Wait, are they, like, doing stuff right now? I'm sorry? Are they, are they like, doing stuff to the computer right now? Definitely. No, it's not right now, sir. Might be a possibility since few time it was coming up, you were not aware about that, okay? And even you can see, sir, there are some other files as well, and these are the junk files you have got in a computer, which is going ahead and making your computer go more slower and slower. Oh, okay. So these are a kind of a junk Just files you have, which are making your computer slower. And these are the infections you have got in your computer. So let me just go ahead and show you, sir, what these infections have done so far in your computer. Okay. Just a moment. Uh, you told that your computer is like uh, three to four years old, right? Uh, yeah. And when was the last time you serviced your computer, sir? Did the last technician not tell you anything, like at all, like follow up? I didn't. I've never had it serviced at all. You don't have any servicing at all, okay? Well, we and like, for what we purpose gave it to do you? We down the street once. Okay, and for what purpose you use this computer for? Uh, I just usually browse the web for it, and I just, <laughs> that made sense. Okay, I, are you a student? No, I, uh, I work uh, a full-time okay. job. Uh-huh, let's just have a look here, sir. These are one of the important services you have got on a computer, okay. and each and every one of them are very important. Can you see these, all of the services which have been put by? Microsoft Corporation in your computer and each and every one is very important. Now, have a look here. Can you see there are some... And can you see... Yeah, I see them. And can you see there are certain services which are unknown. Even you don't know who has manufactured this service. Okay. Can you see this? Yeah. Even we don't know who has manufactured this service and this service is running in a computer. It may be a kind of a virus or infection. <laughs> yeah, and this be. kind of no, unwanted no. service is running in your computer. Oh, but but I thought you said it, the virus wasn't going right now. Are those those uh, those stopped? Oh, are those uh, stop services? Are yes, they, sir. Is this a bad thing? These stop services. No, sir, it's not the stop service. I'm talking about this service. Have a look here. Can you see this is a service? Even you don't know who has manufactured the service. Okay. We don't know what the service is exactly for. And this service is running in your computer. Can you see this? Okay. What about this? This is an unknown service. We don't know. And can you see here? This is some of the important services which are put by Microsoft in the computer. Yep. And that should be in a working manner. And you can see these services are almost. stopped. Yeah. That means, it's clear, sir, the important services of your computer have stopped and the infected of them are running. Okay. And that's the only reason you're getting these warnings because, you know, if obviously, sir, if the important services will stop, you won't be able to use this computer anymore. As you can see, the unwanted files are running in your computer. These are the unwanted files. And not just this, sir. Uh, have a look here. 
Just give me a moment. Let me just go ahead and check the drivers of your computer. Do you know what okay. is drivers? Uh, no, I don't. Okay, let me tell you, sir, if I talk about the drivers, these are one of the very important part of your computer. That they are the only one which helps your computer to connect, uh, like, to communicate between the hardware and the software part. Uh, okay. Now, if we go ahead and check the drivers of your computer, uh, just a moment, it's not showing up. Oh, that's not good. Uh, okay, I believe you're using a Windows XP, right? Uh, yeah, I think so. Okay. Okay, so let me tell you, as you can see here, these are the... F uh, so do you have any idea from where you have got all these infections in your computer? Uh, no. No? Okay. So let me uh, tell you one thing. This is the only computer you have, or do you have any other computer as well, like in your home? Do you have any other computer apart from this one? Uh, this is the only computer that I have. Uh, that, that's the only computer I have. I'm sorry, I didn't get that. <laughs> that's the only computer I have. Okay. Uh, so can you please stop that noise? It's just a bit irritating. Oh, sorry. In so the background. Voice. Okay. So, sir, as you can see the infections you have in your computer, I was just asking, do you know from where these infections are coming in your computer? Uh, no. I don't know. Hello? Okay. Uh, let me tell you, sir, it's all because of the network which you are using. The network under which you are using this computer from there you're getting all these infections. So if you have any other computer or any whoa, other whoa, iPhone, whoa. iPad, which is... On the network? Absolutely, sir. See, network about, is something which... What about my laptop? Uh, let, I'm sorry? What about my laptop? Absolutely, sir. Your laptop is too working under the same network. So I believe your laptop must be having the same infections you have in this computer. Oh, that's that's not good. Maybe that's I'll not good. Let me let me show you, sir, how these things are working. Let me show you. This is all the security issue. I'll show you that. Just a moment. And sir, you told me that you have not serviced this computer since you bought it. That uh, is something yeah. not good at all. You should just keep on servicing your computer so that at least you should know right, right now what is your computer doing, right? Yeah. I, just yeah. let me go ahead and show you that. Do you know what is a firewall? Uh, I, th I think so. Does it block fire? I don't know. Oh, I've heard of that. No, I think it's like a... It's like one of those brick wall thingies that I saw. Oh, yeah. I don't know. I saw it in, like, the settings. It's like a brick wall. Yeah. No, sir. It's a kind of yeah, uh, like it's brick wall. protection. Yeah. yeah, it's a kind of a protection between your computer and the network. Okay. It protects your computer from any kind of infections. Uh, let me show you. Just give me a moment. Okay. Yeah, see, that one's keeping the fire out, like I said. Well, it's too late for that guy. Yeah, yeah, look. Fire. Oh, wait, that one says it's protecting a laptop. I'm sorry, go ahead. That picture right there shows it's protecting a laptop. Uh, I'm sorry, sir, I didn't get you. Can you repeat it once that, again? It, that picture right there, it 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 shows a it shows it's protecting the laptop. Does that mean that my laptop's okay? That, absolutely, sir. See, firewall is something that is a protection between your computer and the network. So if one of your devices is getting infected, these infections can get transferred to your other devices as well. 
So maybe you have the same issues in your laptop as well. Maybe the infections are lower in number. There's a reason it's not doing anything. Once it will be increased in number, you will get the same issues in your laptop as well. Have a look here. Can you see? Look at this picture, the one I'm highlighting in red. Can you see this? Yeah. Yeah. So this is a network you are using, right? And this is the computer which you have, and this is your laptop, which are connected with the laptop. same router and working under the same network. And the, can you see the wall? That is a wall between the network and your computer area, sir. So what happens? Whenever network gives you any kind of things, the wall, what it does, it only takes the proper network, which is safe and secure, and all the infection, it throw it back. In that case, here, all the devices are safe and secure. But again, here in your case, sir, you don't have any protection. So what is happening? All the infections are directly getting in your computer. As first, this, the window XP, this is your window XP, it has just completely with all the infections, so that's the reason it is just about to die. Oh. Might be the laptop which you have, it's okay. partially infected. There's a reason it's not giving any pop-up. Once it will get the higher amount of infections, it will be infected as well. Okay, could you show me you the, get that? Uh, could you show me the infected files again? Definitely sure, i show you that. Give me a moment. I want to see what they look like. Yeah. Is it going to be like that? Like the little thing right there? Oh wait, don't close out of I'm that. I'm sorry, I don't, didn't don't, get don't, that. Don't close out of that. Okay, is this the infected files? Just have a look here. Okay. These all are the infected files you have. And it's not like that. It's not just this much, sir. This are you can see. And there are also other encrypted files which you can't even see. Okay. Yeah, I see that. That's how it works, sir. Right now, your computer is partially filled with infection. That's the reason you're just going on damaging and damaging. Okay, so... So, then, you need... Oh, that's nice. Uh -huh. Okay, so, so, so this was the service thing then? Right here? Absolutely, sir. And these all are the services which are being damaged so okay. far. Can you see this? Uh, yes, yes. And the unwanted of them are running. Absolutely. Let me go ahead and tell you, sir, right now, what all things need to be done in your computer. First okay. of all, you need to fix this computer immediately. And okay. you cannot fix it anywhere, sir. You can take this computer anywhere, get it fixed. But if I talk about the network, it cannot be fixed anywhere. Okay. So what you're in saying... In any case, if you go... What you're saying is there's no firewall, right? So that's a protection, sir. That's a protection. Whenever you have a network, whenever you purchase multiple of devices, you create a protection on above your computer so that you do not get any kind of infection. That's how it works, right? right but, but in your case, sir, you don't have uh, any protection. So all the infections are di directly okay, getting into okay, your computer. Okay. That's all I wanted to know is that I didn't have any protection. That's all I wanted to know. I wanted to verify that. So I have no protection is what you're Absolutely, saying. Absolutely, sir. Okay. That, Absolutely, sir. You don't have any protection so far That's in any of your devices. Okay. That's all I wanted to know. Right. Wait, but I got... On my phone, I got this one app that's like a, a internet security pro or something. Will that sure. help? Sure. Sure. Okay. So that's a kind of an antivirus for your computer. Okay? It's a kind of an antivirus. It's not a protection which will cure you from any kind of thing. See, a firewall protection is something. What it do whenever it get any kind of network, it filter it and just give a proper clean network to your computer. Not an infected one. That are completely safe and secure so that not a single infection can get into your computer. Okay. And everything is safe and secure. So now even if you go ahead and repair this computer, remove all the infections, Turn on all the services in a good manner, fix each and everything, and connect it back with the same network, you will again oh. get these infections back in your computer. Okay. Okay, but before we, like, proceed, um, the other guy we were talking to said that you had a website. Yeah, could, could you show me your website, please? I want to see what company this is. Sure, sure. I'll open it for you, sir. Give me a moment. Right now, you're talking to an online technical support company that is Live PC Expert. Okay? Okay. Uh, let me open it up for you. So you can go ahead and check our website here. Have a look here. Okay. Just a moment. Okay. 
yeah so this is the online technical support company we have we are working under the guidelines of bbb we have got a third score can you see this oh, you're working all over the globe and this is our toll free number you have we generally work for all the security issues all the software issues and if you can go ahead and see the our trust rate we have got millions of trust rate you know every customer the thing we have resolved so far you can see here we work under the I... we have the guideline of pci dnb site log and everything we talk and so it's verified and secured you guys have a YouTube okay. channel? I'm sorry? You got you have a YouTube channel? No sir, there is no YouTube channel. It's just a website we have. Well yeah, but on the side right there it says YouTube. Yeah. I'm sorry. It, right on the side right there it says yeah, there. YouTube. Oh you do have a channel, look at that. Okay. Surprised you don't know that. No, sir, so you can go ahead and have a rep a check on all the wherever you want. Okay, so don't worry about that. Facebook page too. I'll be sure to get that later. Okay, all right. I'm done playing around now. You can. Okay, I got what I want. All right. So uh, what should we do about this? You can uh, go ahead and check the complete website. Don't worry about that. Okay, we are one of the leading companies which provide technical support not to a single brand. We provide technical support to the multiple brands for all the software and security issues. Okay, yeah. And that's the only reason your computer ma has generated. Ma'am, what, uh -huh. what was your name again? You never told me your name. I'm sorry? You never told me your name. Yeah, my name is Ankita. It's A as in Alpha, okay. N as in Nancy, okay. K as in Kilo, okay. I as in Indiana, okay. T is in Tango, okay. A is in Alpha. It's Ankita. I want the senior easy, technician right? on the floor. Okay, well, nice to meet you, Ankitel. I'm Richard, and this is my roommate here. Uh, whatever name he wants. Yeah, to I'm Tommy. Him. Tommy. Okay. Okay, sorry. I always have to introduce myself, otherwise I feel bad. Okay, go ahead. I'm sorry, I can't hear you. Can you be a bit louder? Go ahead. Keep, what do we got to do about this? Absolutely. So if you... What I can best do for you, sir, I can provide you a technician who will go ahead and take care of it and everything. He will remove all the infections you have in your computer. He will repair all the damages so far which is caused by the infection. Okay. And yes, he's also going to take care of the network which you're using. He will also be protecting the network so that even in future you will not face any problem with your devices. There will okay. be no more. And also we are providing certain warranties. Like a certain period of time, we are providing you a complete two year of unlimited technical support on your computer and on your other devices. Okay. Okay. Um. Okay. So what what do we do now? So what do you want me to do? <laughs> so I don't want to do anything, sir. If you want to fix this, I'll go ahead and provide you a technician who will go ahead and fix all these things for you. you I'll get you registered with us. Once I provide the customer ID, according to the customer ID, the technician will immediately start the work on your computer, okay? Okay, but, okay. All right. Absolutely, sir. So let me tell you, we are not just going to fix your computer, we are also going to fix your network. Okay. We'll fix your this computer, we'll fix your network, we'll protect the network so that you will not get any more infections in any of your devices, okay? Okay. So for that, I just need you to get registered with us. I need few of your details. I need your name, first and last name. I need your email. Uh, just a moment. Can you give me one minute? Uh, okay. Uh, Richard, just give me one minute. Just a minute, okay? Yeah. So your name is Richard. Richard McRichardson. Okay. And then you have to go ahead and type your email. So I can send each and everything written and documented on your email. Uh, okay, hold on, I gotta, okay. Uh-huh. I have a weird email, it's, uh... Don't judge that email, that's really weird. Are you still there? Yes, sir, I'm still there for you. I'm just generating the report so that you don't have to explain anything to the technician. I need your phone number as well so that when the technician is working on the computer, if the call got disconnected, you can give us the call back. 
Thanks a lot. And I also pro uh, need your billing address. Okay. Okay. Uh, what? Wait. Oops. There you go. You still there? Sir, I'm there. Just give me a moment. I'm just checking all the in infections with the technician. I'll let you know how much it will cost you. Just give me one minute, okay? All right, I muted the call real quick. So this is the first one so far. We haven't had the uh, coop face virus. Maybe it'll come later. Okay, sir. So uh, we are going to. We're not just going to. Are you there with me? Yes, I'm still here. Hello. Can you hear me? Yes. 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 I'm still here. Okay. So actually, you know what? You're you're just breaking up. So whatever you're speaking, I'm unable to hear that. Okay, let me just go ahead and tell you, I'm going to provide you a complete one year of unlimited technical support on your computer. That means it's not just for today. Once I go ahead and fix this computer for you today, I'm also going to provide you a complete one year of additional uh, unlimited technical support on the computer. That means after fixing today, if you face any problem tomorrow, within 365 days, any problem, you can call on the same number and get your machine fixed free of course. There will be no additional charges, okay? Okay. Everything will be written and documented. I will immediately send a receipt and each and everything on your mail, okay? There will be no additional charges. Okay. And it will cost you in, Cana uh, in Canadian dollar, right? It will cost you 300 and nineteen dollar and ninety nine cents. Like okay, which is in, okay. which is two forty nine and ninety nine in US dollar. Actually we charge in US dollars, okay? okay? Just give me a moment sir, I'll just go ahead and fill out the form and then I will just get you registered and I will immediately transfer this call to the technician who will start working on your computer. Okay. Okay. Can you please ref check the information which you have provided me? Are they all correct? It's correct. It's correct. Sir, can you hear me? Yes, it's correct. Okay. So thanks a lot. Just give me one minute. Stop holding the phone upside down. <sighs> so you have to be a bit patient with me, okay? Just give me one minute. I gotta sneeze. Sick of being sick. Don't they have like hold music or something? I don't. I don't think so. Infinite hold.
So uh, how are you going to pay for it? Oh, I'm going to use a... Uh... Do we like split it? Or... I guess so. I'm gonna use a... I mean, so... do we just give them both cards and then they can like do it? Like split it, maybe? <laughs> oh, let's see. Like, like when you pay, you know, at a restaurant or something, you just give half and half? Yeah. I think we should, yeah, we do that. muted my mic again, or muted the mic for the um, call, but like, yeah, we've got uh, pretty solid evidence, yeah. so. Uh, Mr. Richard, can you please rep check your email address? Uh, it's correct, and it's, it's Mick Richardson, not it's Mr. It's correct, Richard. it's T-U-P-O-S-J-I-F-I-S-A-S-H at gmail.com you read right? it wrong okay you read it wrong moment. but yeah that's correct Play my old hold music here in a minute. We don't get any hold music. Too cheap. Down, 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 down. Too cheap for hold music. Yeah, man, gotta save them pennies. <laughs> oh, I do get tired of hearing all the same hold music. Did you die, ma'am, or what? Yeah, what's happening over there? Uh, sir, are you speaking to me? Yeah. Uh, sir, I need a few minutes. I'm just uh, generating a report of each and everything, and we just have to send the technician, okay? So just one minute. <sighs> okay. I'm getting an error in your email. Are you sure this is the correct email you have? Yeah. Why do you gotta yell every time we come back? Okay. Uh, sir, please have a rest check, please. It's T U P O S J I F I S A F H at gmail dot com, right? Yeah. Oh, wait. I think I think you forgot an S. Okay. Please make it correct. Uh. Yeah, yeah, uh, because I, I have... remember there was a shh at the end. Is it correct? Uh, yeah. 
Uh, do you have any other email which you can provide me apart from this uh, one? It's not going I, to. I can put my email in if you want. Sure, you can. I'll appreciate okay. that. Yeah. Okay. It's. I'm just gonna tell it to you. It's a. It's Tom. The uh -huh. gamer. Nineteen ninety-eight XD in caps. Okay. Minecraft. <laughs> hey, that's a big one. At gmail dot com. Yeah, I was surprised they let me have that one, but I wanted mine to stand out. Okay. <laughs> that's all right. That's a good email, sir. Yeah. So your name is Tom. Yes. I already okay. told you that. I feel sad. Uh -huh. They can't uh, remember anything. Okay. Like, okay. taking forever. Ma'am, why do you keep disappearing into oblivion? Uh, so I'm done. Just one minute more. Jesus. I'm so sorry. Yeah, we just There's got something this wrong thing in this to go to in a little bit. Didn't they give you phone training there? I really apologize. Just give me one more minute, sir. Okay? <sighs> Okay. I'm timing. I'm tired of being sick, I gotta sneeze again. <laughs> you got 30 seconds. Uh, sir, that's all. It's done. <laughs> Just give me one minute. Alright. Okay. So in the while I'm talking, uh, I'm doing this, you can just have a few words with me. What do you do? Huh? Which one of us? Yes, yes, sir. Just one moment, please. What are you doing? It's taking so long. Okay. So here we go. Is that your only plan? <laughs> yeah. 
Okay, so I'm just going to open the form on your side. You just have to rep check all the details you provided are correct. Just a minute. Okay. <sighs> Calls been going on for fifty eight minutes. Okay, so Mr. Richard, here we go. Just have a look on your screen and please rest check over all the uh, details, okay, that you provided me. Uh, I really apologize for that, okay? I took a long time of yours. No, not mine. Just hey, is this, uh, is this your guys' website? I I'm sorry, I didn't get that. I is this your guys' website? <laughs> Hello? Uh, yes, sir, go ahead. What, is, is this your website? Yes, sir. That's our website. Oh, okay. Oh, it looked kind of different for a minute. I thought it was different than the one the other guy showed us. No. No, sir. Because I, didn't, I didn't see that. So, are you guys... It shows all these uh, countries up here. Are you guys located in those... In all of them? Yes, sir. All of them. We have different uh, branches okay. in every state. Yeah. Okay. Please go ahead and rep check all these details, okay? And please, if there's some mistake, please correct that, okay? Uh, they look, they look have right. a look here. It looks right. <sighs> yeah, that's, that's right. It's all right. Hello? Yes, sir. Is that all correct? I said that like three times. It's yes. Make sure the phone number which you provided me is correct, okay? Yes. And the email, because I will be sending it and everything right now, written and documented on your email. <sighs> yes, that, that's correct. It's all correct. Everything. Okay. So I'm just going ahead and putting a default password. There will be just one, two, three, four, five, six, okay? Later on, if you want, you can change that. Okay. Uh huh. So here we go. So you can please go ahead and choose which card you will be using for the payment. This will be a Visa, Master, or Discover, okay? Uh, it's a Visa. Okay. And please check the card number which appears on the on your Visa card, okay? Okay. Uh, say it? Do you have any middle name as well? Uh, no, I don't. Okay. Then you can go ahead and type in the card numbers and all, but make sure you don't make any space, space or anything, because Wait, everything uh, will be encrypted. Okay, I guess. Wait, I but we were gonna, we were gonna like split the payment with both of our cards. Is there a way we could do that? Uh, I'll, uh... I I'm sorry, I didn't get that. Can you repeat it? We, we were gonna split the payment with both of our cards. Sir, you're breaking up. But with both of our cards, we're gonna split the payment. <laughs> uh, I'll, I'll, I'll figure it out later. I'll just... Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Please don't make any space. Yeah, we got pizza coming on the way, so we gotta... Okay. Uh, okay, that's fine, sir. Uh, we can just, uh, I'll send it and everything on your email, so don't worry about that. Okay, just give me one minute, a uh, short one. Yeah, so you can just check this box and you can click on submit, and that's all. And I'll immediately start the work on your computer, okay? Yeah, and do you authorize live PC export to charge your Visa card by 249 in Europe? 
for complete one year of unlimited technical support on your computer. Is it a yes? Uh, yep. Oh, oops. Something happened. Okay. I believe you have made some mistake. Uh, uh, just a moment. No, actually, I think, uh, I think you're the one that made the mistake. Um, so, okay, so you are a scam company. I've been sitting here... <laughs> We've been sitting here playing along with this game. We both uh, have experience in IT work, and we both know what we're doing. Yeah. You have performed... I'm, I'm, you breathe really loud, by the way. And you're really irritating. I'm sick of listening to it. So this fake software that you put on here is... Uh, it's basically from... It's uh, Lothware or Lothane something? I don't know how you say um, that. Adware, just call it. Adware. Yeah. Anyway... This program, Sir, this pro just... no, no, shut up. I've been listening to you talk for the past hour. I don't care anymore. Now, this program is fake. It gives you fake errors until you actually buy the real version. Um, and let, I'll show you that here in a minute. Um, so first of all, let me tell you, I can't understand. No, 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 no. Shut up. Just it shut doesn't up. matter if you can't understand us. It just matters that you're a scammer. Can you understand that? Hold on. Let me show you. Let me show you some of these things. Okay. I've got a lot of stuff okay, to show you. Okay, go ahead. While you've been sitting here flapping your lips and being on hold for five hours, I've been sitting here collecting a lot of information about you. Ugh, this thing's being irritating this slow. Okay. No. Yeah. So now I found two articles. Uh huh. About that PC scan thing that you've been using. That's one article. Sure. First of all, let me tell you. No, 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 I've listened to you talk for the past hour, I'm not going to, you can talk when I say you can talk, that's when you can talk. No. Sure, sure, go ahead. No. Let me show you this. I gotta find mm -hmm. it. Uh, I hate when I do this, I can never remember where I found something at. Basically, this program, if you sit here and read some of these, if I can find it again. Basically, this program gives fake errors until you buy the real version to fix errors that aren't there. And all these errors that I came up with are fake. What you have been telling me is you and your other technician have been sitting here lying to me saying that I didn't have an antivirus. When literally, I mean, you must... Uh, okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show and, you this. And, wait, you... When you said transfer the call, you literally... He had to literally hand over the phone to you. Right. I mean, do you have... Okay. This is a virtual machine, so I'm going to show you something. So these files that you're showing me, these prefetch files that you're showing me, these are not hacking intrusions. These are normal junk files in your computer. They're not hacking intrusions. This, you said uh, this is unknown. If you were to read this, and this says Komodo Internet Security, which is an antivirus, and you said I didn't have an antivirus. You also said I didn't have a firewall, which there's a firewall built right into Windows, which I'm, if you were a real technician, you would know that. Look at that. There it is, firewall. And and I think I think he literally transferred over to you because he saw the firewall was working fine and couldn't think of a, of an excuse to say that there was a virus. And you can contradict whatever you want to because we have this completely recorded in audio and video and it'll be uploaded to the public. If you see this, I, this is this Komodo Internet Security has a third party built in firewall to it, so there's actually two firewalls on the system. Detected threats zero, blocked intrusions zero, network intrusions zero. There is nothing wrong with this computer. The results that came up on this is fake. I have CCleaner cleanup uh, as long as mal along with malware bytes, excuse me, along with Spybot, and I'll show you that here too. Once it opens up, okay, nothing, nothing. Oh, she hung up.